All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to some more God of War Ragnarok. My name is Raven from the Sky. Now let's do this. Well, brother, before you see the lad again, might we discuss an approach? He will tell me where he has been. That is my approach. Ah, classic Spartan diplomacy. Wait. Did you say Odin invited him to Asgard, and then he disappeared for two days? Aye. But surely the lad's got more sense than to... Don't underestimate Odin's powers of persuasion. He filled my son's head with lies. Why wouldn't he do the same with yours? Hmm. And you tell that one-eyed nutsucker he owes me one! Fight me now and eternally! Well, looky there! Glad you can make the trip, your goddessness! I put your sigil magic on the young turd's bow. But then he and Sindri got into it over something. Mm, I don't rightly know who's yelling at who in there, but I figure they both got it coming. Well, come on, then. Hey, Tyr! Wake up! You got company. Now, why don't you just make yourself at home in Sindri's so-called study over yonder? You sure he won't mind? Mind? Joints get... Hey, you see we're great right? You better screw his head back on. And I mean tightly. So you're back. Are you ready to answer me? About what? Where did you go? What did you see? Was it Odin? What? Is that what you think? Do you deny it? <laughs> answer me! Did you go to Asgard? No! Of course not! But so what if I did? It's my future, it's my life! You are my son! Then why don't you trust me? If you want me to trust you, then tell me the truth! The truth is you're being a complete asshole! Laddie, you know that's no way to change a man's mind! He doesn't have any faith in me! It's fine if he keeps secrets, it's fine if Mom did! That is not fine! Her secrets are hard to every step of this path! Oh, okay. So you don't believe in her anymore either? This is not about your mother! What you have done is lie. Wonder where I learned that. That's quite enough. Since when do you always take his side? Since he became the one making sense. Look, I was only thinking about going to Odin. But I swear it's for a good reason. There is no good reason to go to Odin. He'll only cloud your mind. But I'd be going for us. I, I gotta stop something bad from happening. Something bad did happen. Look at me. At Freya, at Tia, Odin did this to us. What's got everyone caterwauling all of a sudden? Atreus wants to go to Asgard. Asgard? Get kicked in the head or something? Great. I guess everybody's against me now. You must choose who you are going to be. Are you going to continue to lie and keep things from me? Or are you my son? Choose? I never get to choose. Just leave me alone. Listen. Let go of me. Listen. Say, let go. What the fuck? Atreus. It's Sindri. Just, just try to keep control. Oh, that's great. Freak is cold. Lots of Hellwalkers. Definitely in Midgar. Keep it coming. You're just helping me stay warm. These things! When did it get so bad out here? The Alpha! Ugh. 
Gotta find some shelter. At least something out here doesn't want to kill me. Just need someplace warm. Then I can figure out where to go next. The runaway. Uh, that doesn't look good. What is this thing? Some kind of white? Stop up! What is it you want? Furious sentient magic, unite by a singular purpose, the destruction of life, a natural defense response, considering life has given way to Ragnarok. A white is created when a group of three wisps converge into one whole angry creature. If we come across three wisps as they are converging, it's quite possible to disrupt the process. No need to add how strongly I recommend doing so, but every little nudge helps. More ravens. You trying to tell me something? First, he thinks I've been to Asgard. Then, flying. Ah! I'm trying to save your life, you big jerk!
Find shelter and then what? Where could I go? If I go to Asgard, following the prophecy where Father ends up dead, if I stay locked up at home, there's nothing I can do to stop it. I Gee. guess in Asgard, I could at least keep an eye on Odin. Uh, yeah, I would. No. Find out his plan. Get control of this. No, that's not gonna work. He'd know you're there. Odin's like an elder god. He'd know you're there. Knows what you're doing now with the Raven spies. That's stupid. Don't, don't, man. It's like, I know. It's, he feels like it's damned if you do, damned if you don't. It oh, is. Who am I kidding? I can't go to Asgard. Exactly. Now you're thinking. It's like you saw what it did in the first God of War to everyone. Wait, are those red leaves? Freya's house. to let me into that house. Think you can do that? Come on, Charlie. You have to do this. I... I can't help if you don't... Emily! Emily! Buddy, I know it's cold in here. <sighs> she closed that window before snooping around. Freya hasn't been checking on you, All right? Too busy hunting us down. Come on, let's get you warmed up. Should be able to make a fire from all this mess. Is this Baldur's? Wonder how Father was able to earn her forgiveness. Valkyrie armor? Does this go with the wings on the wall? From her friend? Wonder what happened to her. I can't believe she never came back to check on her house, to check on you. That's not an excuse. Yo, 
You're welcome. Where do I go now? I can't stay. I just can't let my dad die, too. There's gotta be something I can do. He's here for me. I'll be okay. I think. Okay. I'm ready. Take me to him. Should have learned to swim before Midgard froze over. Charlie. Freya must have been so obsessed with hunting us that she neglected her giant tur turtle house. Her so-called friend. When I first saw Charlie out in the cold, I thought he might be dead. He's alive, but he's freezing out there alone. I lit a fire to keep him warm, but he's going to need someone to stay with him full time if he's going to survive much longer. Hello? I'm here. Odin? Bird, is this Asgard? Hey, wait up! The wall! This is Asgard! Hold on! I'm coming! Oh! You don't seem friendly. <laughs> Hey, Odin, I thought you said I was welcome in Asgard. Can't catch. Yeah, danger. I know. Got it. I see him. Jump up.
Well, this might be the craziest thing I've ever done. But if that's what it takes to change father's fate. He's trying to change his dad's fate. That's Hey! Where? Me... Where'd you go? Let's go screw up somebody else's. Hold on! I'm coming! Just gotta find a way through. Everything I came to Asgard for is on the other side of that wall. What am I gonna say to Odin? Uh, hi. I came to be your apprentice, I guess? But it doesn't mean I, like, serve you now. Not in a foretold by prophecy kind of way. Jumper! that wall wait how do i get past the wall i never came up with a mere story about hrimfer the stonemason's son built a flaw into it he only told frey about it and i didn't think to ask hold on i was frey at the house did she move in with us you know what focus loki Father would just burn this away with his blades. But what can I do? Gotha. Huh. Maybe that sigil magic on my bow can help. What did Brock say? If I could just get that fire to spread to the bramble. Wait, that sounds like people. help? You, uh, you look a little lost. Oh, uh, I'm just getting my bangs. Well, there's nothing to see this way except the big wall. Is there a gate to go through? <laughs> nope. Not unless you're an Aesir god, but I guess you'd know that if you were an Aesir god. Me? No. I'm from Midgard. What? No shit. Me too. I'm skilled here. Lucky. Hang on. Are you all from Midgard? <laughs> yep. The uh, Allfather saved us from the desolation. 
Gave us a safe place to settle, but we don't go in there. Can't get into the city unless you know magic. Do you... you don't know magic, do you? A little bit, yeah. What? No shit. You, can you walk through walls? Not yet. Huh. Couldn't I just climb over it? <laughs> that? Without any gear? Uh, no. Aren't you afraid of dying? Well, yeah. I mean, look at that. But, Odin awaits. Wait, you know the Allfather? I'm sort of his apprentice. No shit! What is he teaching you? I'm not sure. Well, how many other students? I don't know. How long are you staying? You don't know. Okay. I'm gonna go climb that wall now. Well, this I gotta see. Need help? I appreciate it, but I gotta go alone. Oh, I wasn't gonna climb with you. I may owe Odin my life, but I don't owe him my death. Not that I think you're gonna fall. Forget I said anything. <laughs> Is that Hugin? Is Hugin your guide? Who? Odin's raven. You know, from Hugin and Moonin. Oh, pretty good guy. Hugin and Moonin. These two aren't like the spies we see around the realms. Hugin and Mugen are Odin's own weird magical pets. Back at the house, I saw them disappear into his tattoos. Mimir told me once how they became how they came to be that way. How they were normal ravens once until Odin captured their whole unkindness. Most of them he roasted and ate for supper. But on Hugin and Mugen he experimented. Wiping their memories and binding them to his will. Mira also referred to them as right picks, even for birds. Though, not sure he'll know too much about climbing. you die. Thanks. Me too. I, you know not to look down, right? I like looking down. Shows me how much progress I've made. Wow. Yeah, that's great. Can I use that? I mean, a little ironic last words, but... What was that? Nothing. Nothing. Hey... You're doing great! Thanks, Gilder. Hope you're right. <laughs> okay, I can do this. This is fine. Just keep climbing. And now where? I'm totally fine looking down.
Look at that view. Hey, Hoogan. Don't suppose you'd like to pass the time by telling a story, would ya? Yeah, that's what I thought you'd say. A wife? Up here? Yeah, I'm coming. Let's get that chain down. I wonder why I can't hear your thoughts. Sure seemed like Odin could. That was you in our cabin, right? You and your brother, I guess? Taking that for a yes. We are breathe and yes. I bet I'm past the worst of it now. <clears throat> or not. Uh, 
Want to just let me pass through? No? Have it your way. Yeah, up, oh, I get it. Connected. Yeah, that made sense. I think. Gotta do both sides, though. Made it. Ah! Woke up more with. Jump up. Get to fly. I'm doing what I can. Huh. I don't see any more shortcuts. Just gotta climb a little further. Maybe a lot further. But I've come this far. Hugin, how about I tell you a story? Once, there was a giant named Loki, who thought it'd be a good idea to accept Odin's invitation to Asgard. <gasps> so, Odin tested Loki, expecting him to climb, by himself, all the way up Primter's wall. <sighs> so, what did Loki... Ah! So what did Loki do? He kept climbing. He just kept climbing. His arms hurt. His fingers went numb. It got hard to breathe. Loki kept climbing. One foothold at a time. 
All the way to the top. Nowhere to go but up. Okay, okay. Keep going. Come on. Can't stop now. Can't stop, won't stop. <sighs> oh, come on. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. Almost there. Hello. Uh, hi. So, what part of the enormous wall made you think, oh, visitors must be welcome? I was sent for, actually, by Odin. The Allfather sent for you. <laughs> Great. Then why are you out there, and not in here? Why don't we ask them together? Hmm. Ah! Are you finished? Now, what could Odin, all father, King of the Aesir, possibly want with the likes of you. That's between me and Odin. You don't even know, do you? <laughs> think you could pull me up, or... <sighs> no, I don't think I will. I think maybe I'll drop you. No. No, 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 no. Yes, I'm Stop. going to drop you. Goodbye. Stop. Wait, wait, wait. Think how mad the Allfather's gonna be when, when he finds out you killed his guest. Loki of the Jotnar. <laughs> the Jotnar. Enemy of my people. I am not your enemy. I will be the judge of that. <laughs> this way, Loki of the Jotnar. Wait, is that Gallerhorn? Are you Heimdall? Obviously. Now feel free to drink in the splendor of Asgard. This is a rare sight for outsiders. Especially giants. Yes. Why not steal anything that is not nailed down? That is sure to impress your hosts. Just ask your questions already. How do you know I had questions? It is my job. Next question. What is your job? I protect the realm I love from trouble. And you think I'm trouble? You just met me. And I can already see you are eager to prove yourself. Way too eager. Probably due to an overshadowing father figure you can never live up to. Good guess. I would also guess that you are... disrespectful. Entitled and impulsive. You don't know me at all. I help people. Oh, you are here to help people. Hmm. No, no. 
You are here to help yourself. To manipulate and lie to whoever you have to to get what you want. I know you're young. Your voice probably dropped while you were climbing the wall, but... <laughs> What a twisted little soul you have. <laughs> you are chaos in a spiffy archer suit. I watch your mouth move and I see cities burning. Nothing good is going to come from you being in Asgard. That said, if you are here to aid the Allfather and have no treacherous intent, I guess that makes us allies. So, come along. Top here for day, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like and subscribe to the channel and see if you grow. Take care and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.